Lads, it's like musical chairs with you three, unfortunately, with injuries and things like that. Sam, we start with you. You had a great Galway, things were going really well, and you're unfortunate then to break your leg, but you shouldn't be out for too long. Uh, yeah, look, it was great to come back for Galway, and uh, great to get a few winners banged in back in the board, but unfortunately, these things happen. Um, shouldn't be out for too much longer. Everything's went well so far. I seem to be healing quick and recovering quick, so uh, hopefully now I'll be back riding out within the next four or five weeks. Hopefully. When you came back from the last injury, you built up a real good partnership with Peter Fatty as well as obviously here for the boss, Gordon Elliott, then riding plenty of winners for him. So it's good to have an outside yard as well that you're riding winners for. Yeah, exactly. And uh, great, to, great to ride winners for Peter and the winner for Gordon in Galway. Um, but Peter's been very good to me since I started. And um, yeah, great connection that yard, and hopefully, hopefully this stays out. Jordan, you've had a lengthy spell on the sidelines, unfortunately. You were out for a little while, you came back for Punchestown, then you were gone again. But you came back last week in Kilbeg and five winners already in just over a week. Um, a winner last night for uh, your old boss, Colin Bow, as well. So delighted to be back and especially to to get off to such a good start with those five winners. Yeah, great, Dave. Um, last night was, was great. Um, Especially for Colin, he was very good to me when I was starting off and still is. Um, great to get a couple for Gordon as well. Um, he's, he's been very good to me since, since I joined here. And uh, no, one for David Christie as well. So him also, when, when I was riding behind the pine seat, he looked after me well too. So it's great. Um, I have a great agent, Gary Cribben, behind me. Um, he's doing a wonderful job. And uh, no, just to get back here as well, it was great. And Jennifer Pugh and all the team in Santry, a big thanks to them. And Gary Cribben looks after the three of you? Yeah, that's yeah. right. Yeah. Brilliant. And Danny, of course, Galway was the, the highlight of your career so far. You're only young, and but you've had, I suppose, these two being out injured has kind of helped you, hasn't it, um, to give you those opportunities. And Jack was out as well at the same time. Yeah, I know. It wasn't ideal, but I was just very lucky to be in the position I was when, when the lads were, were out. And uh, I, I can't thank Gordon enough for the amount of opportunities. He's given me, and as you said, Galway, it was unbelievable, really. To For anybody to win a Galway play, as the man beside you knows all about it when he won it last year, but for you, being from Galway, it's extra special then? Yeah, it, it took it took a while to really sink in, I suppose. Um, look, it'll be, um, next year it'll be, it'll be hard, hard bet um, to get ahead this year, but sure, look, hopefully, hopefully things can keep going the way they are. And you're on the sidelines at the moment with a broken collarbone, but you, like Sam, you should you you probably be back even before Sam, so you don't have too long to wait. Yeah, I, I cracked my shoulder blade actually. Oh, shoulder, sorry. Uh, it was this day three weeks ago, and I the hospital Tuesday, so hopefully get a bit of good news then and see see hopefully it won't be too far away before I'm back. Sam, the three of you, he's lived together. He's our great friends. He's worked together. Jack Hendy's the number one man, um, but isn't it brilliant? Obviously, he's a rival. He wants to sit on the best horses, but it's important that he's get on well together, and that, that's a huge benefit to Gordon as well, that he's get on so well. Yeah, look, um, we obviously get on very well. We haven't uh, killed each other yet, living with each other anyway. Well, yourself and Jordan do fight a little bit, don't you? But... A little bit, but uh, it's harmless. And um, look, it's, it's probably great. Great for the yard that we're good friends as well as very competitive with each other. Uh, but um, look, there's never any hard feelings written. And it's not just three of you, these are very close to Jack as well. So the four of you together are the four main riders here in the yard, and these are such close friends. So huge benefit to Gordon that, like I said to Sam, that he's getting on so well, Jordan. Yeah, brilliant. Um, look, if we're going to do that in the evenings or the weekends, we'd all go do it together. If we're going racing, we share a lift, so it's great. But not just that, it's a uh, when we come down to riding the horse for Garden, he always says work as a team and we always do. Um, obviously Jack's number one and if Jack rode, would ask him and he, he'd never hold anything against us or, or wouldn't tell, tell us that. And we're all trying to do our best and uh, there's a great team there. The open day, of course, uh, today. I couldn't believe the crowd. I was here last year, there was big crowds, but definitely a lot more today. The weather does help, but huge crowds, people within race and people with outside race. And so it's great to see all these people come in the gates and get to see what you guys and especially what Gordon does with all these horses. Yeah, exactly. Um, exactly. Today was great. Uh, a, lot, a lot of good horses here and uh, a lot of upcoming future horses. Um, are those horses here for, for, for shares today for sale. And uh, it was a great day and food and drinks and everyone enjoyed it. So uh, yeah, no, it's getting bigger every year. 
Danny, any particular horse you're looking forward to for the season ahead, whether you're going to ride it or not ride it, that's here in the yards? And look, there, there's plenty of them there. Obviously, the main one is probably bright, that, the brighter days ahead. Um, she looked very impressive last year. Just look forward to see what she can do this oncoming season. Sam, what about you? There's a lot of nice young horses, the one pointy points there coming forward. Um, horse I really liked last year was Trim Castle, and he's done everything right. He won in Castletown Gagan. Yeah, he won his fire over well. Always nice horse at home, so hopefully he shows us something nice. Jordan, more about yourself, obviously the obvious one for you. You're hoping to pick up that partnership with Jerry Klom again, but any younger horse there to keep an eye out for that you're looking forward to? Um, yeah, he's a well-known horse called Down Memory Lane. Um, he was bought off the Fogarty's in Wexford. Um, won a bumper very impressive. In, in uh, Fairy House for Derek O'Connor. Yeah, uh, Gordon bought the third horse in the same bumper and he went on to win a maiden hurdle last week. So the form is all there and uh, no, he's, he's special. It's a Listen, lads, keep up the good work. Hopefully the two of yous on the outside are back soon from injury and that all of yous continue to ride winners. And it's a good season for yous. Thanks, Thanks.